This is the Zarite Crossbow. It costs over 500 mil and it strengthens the effects of enchanted bolts by 10%. And the special attack guarantees the special effect of an enchanted bolt to occur with double the accuracy. Do you know what I'm thinking? Oh my word, that's... Cool. Um, yeah, if you didn't already guess, yeah, we're going to be using the Dragonstone Dragon Bullies. 100% chance of it proccing. The only problem is if people anti-fire, then... It doesn't work. You know what? Let's go for this Inquisitor guy. The Dragon Breath's just gonna absolutely tear through his armor. You ready for this? Yep, you can save to full HP. It's not gonna save you, though. Nope. That Gmol's not happening today. Sorry, mate. Hmm. Guy was risking a fury. 3.4 mil. I don't know how I feel about being only 52 prayer with a 500 mil weapon. Just gotta keep an eye on that prayer. But the downside to that is if I'm keep sipping prayer potions, I can pop one myself where I can't eat. Oh my god, that's huge. The hits are sick enough on this account, but wait until they go an account with rigor and maxed range strength. I'm getting attacked by a level 100 piety account, which is not great. And good fight. 60. Level 100 down. So obviously you could say, what's the point in using a 500 mil crossbow when there's such thing as a 500k ballista? Well, the ballista spec gives you 25% accuracy. This crossbow is double accuracy. Yeah, it's pretty good. That actually could be it. No! Look at his risk. You know what? Let's attack the piety count with an anguish. I'm so dead. Let's not do that again. So I've just made a discovery with these barbed bolts. This is actually mad. Watch what happens. Ace Defender is a free-to-play SRPG mobile game featuring monster battles, but also has elements of tower defense games. Choose between 48 heroes, with two new heroes being added every two weeks to create a powerful lineup and take on over 40 chapters with nearly 2,000 levels. Level up your heroes and collect items by engaging in trials, exploring dungeons and regions, but also there is PvP. You can fight against other players within your server or across server in different arenas. And who better to use in PvP battles, but also PvE battles, that's the newest hero, Brenda the Demon Spear, who has the ability to deal massive damage, limits her own opponent's damage, and recovers health on her own. The Realm of DTs will be an update coming very soon, where you'll be able to build your own castle, fight all kinds of monsters for rewards, develop technology, gain more power for your soldiers through magical research, and train them to conquer the city for endless treasures. You can download the game for free by clicking the link in the description, and you'll get yourself 10 royal recruitment tickets by completing chapter 2, level 8. And you can use the tickets by clicking the sky city, then the tavern, and then recruit 10 times. Like I said, it's free, you might as well give it a go. Thank you to Ace Defender for sponsoring the video. Clean. Didn't even have to eat. Dragon crossbow as a main hander, big mistake. I'm just gonna avenge that all day long. Like so. I really, really wanna smite someone. So I'm not gonna bolt spec. I'm gonna wait for a good XP drop and then quadruple dragon throw next spec. 68, I didn't even spec. That's the passive effect of the Zarite bow kicking in. We gain two extra max hits on Dragonstone Dragon Ball E's. Let's attack this guy in Carol's. The Dragon Knives are like never gonna hit, but you never know. The crossbow will though, double accuracy. I'm just gonna spec him. I'm risking it. I killed him. I killed a guy in full Carol's. 5.5 mil. Oh my god. Ah <laughs> oh dear, that's funny. Oh, I should be get a region bracelet. See, he was out of food, so he went for the panic spec. Berserkering Bandos Chaps, region bracelet and manacles. 5.4 mil. No way. No! The guy was risking Elder Mall and tore over 20 mil. Sad scam, scam game. game. Huh. I actually really like this combo when it hits. I 
I smited him. No! Damn it, his plus one was a ballista. 1.1 mil. He's looting. You ready for this? <laughs> oh, I feel bad. I'm the worst human being in the world. Go on, rush me. Go on. Good fight. He didn't have his prayer up to begin with, but I still smite him for the debug, so we'll take it. Bit rude. Tell you what, you have to die quickly. One point eight mil. Lovely combo, no smite though. One point six mil. I'm afraid to say it's game, game over. over. Big stack. Fury PK. 5.4 mil. This guy's apparently risking 35 mil. I'm probably gonna die, but you never know. Why is he risking so much? I mean, I'm not gonna question it. No way. You realize if he hit my vengeance with that ballista, that was actually perfect. But I've been risking low HP so he actually fights me again. So hopefully it pays off. That could be it. Yes! Is that Prims? Is that... Wait. Did it PK Prims? Where's the prim? Oh my word. 33.5 mil. He lied. He said he was risking 35 mil. I think it's time we pull out the rigor account in maxed range strength. We can now hit in the 70s, so this is going to be interesting. That's huge. How's he alive? Please tell me. He's dead. 1.2 mil. 83 stack. Oh my word. 69.29. 75. People are so surprised by it. Oh my word. Um, I mean, I have nothing to say. That is massive. Oh my god. 1.3 mil. My vent here, big ball. No way, it's a zero. That guy was risking Bless Sara Sword, Serp Helm, and an Elder Maul. Zero on my vengeance. That's gotta be it. Oh my word, 73, 27? <laughs> That's 100 stack. I've collected some data. 58 people that I fought didn't anti-fire. However, 15 people did anti-fire. I'm sure after this video, a lot more people are going to anti-fire, which makes the Dragonstone Dragon Ball E's not that great. The Onyx Ball E's hit higher with the spec than the Opal Dragon Ball E's. Oh my god. Yes. Darug Fury PK, 5.2 mil. The bolt spec's not going to hit anywhere near as much, but at least we know it's going to hit. No way. <gasps> it doesn't hit massively high, but, but it's higher than if they were anti-fired, so. That's got to be it. Nice, 59. We'll take the Darugs. Is it worth using a fine gemmer weapon to maybe hit a 60? For me, it's Dragonstone Dragon Ball E's or nothing. But I'll tell you a place most people probably won't be anti-fired, and that's Deep Wildy. Let's test it out. If they pray range, well, the crossbow's not going to do much. If they pray mage, the anti-fire doesn't go off, so the AGS gives them more to think about. Crossbow? No, he was anti-fired. Like, why would you do that? Like, that better be my loot. Yes, that's what I thought. That guy's dying. He almost ruined my kill. Two in one. I guessed his world. I guessed his world and he's full TB'd. Got him. Seven mil. If I want to survive, I have to kill him. So then the TB wears off. And he's dead. I need to bang. Damn it. Damn it, I missed the smoke battle stuff in the turn of fire, but still, 3 mil. That should have been the kill. That's gotta be it, surely. Yes, nice. Uh, a little bit low on food here. Just about got out. 2.4 mil. Yes! 
Beautiful kill. <laughs> I killed the bay, that's funny. 10 mil. No, this guy's gonna get me now. That's another bait down, 6.4 mil. Oh, good fight. Deep Wildy, it was pretty disappointing because 90% of the time, the opponents are going to pray range on mage. Praying range nulls 40% of the damage and pretend mage means the Dragon Breath doesn't even work. In terms of in a PvP world, it's exciting seeing the Dragon Breath, but to be honest, you may as well use a 500k Ballista with an Anguish. Still though, video was a success. 85 mil in the invent, 18.8 mil in the looting bag. That's 100 mil PK'd. But I'm not done with this bow yet. I have an idea. 